An implantable cardioverter defibrillator, or ICD, is a small device that checks your heart rhythm. If your heart beats in a dangerous, abnormally fast heart rhythm, the ICD will give your heart a small shock or electrical impulse to try to reset the heart's electrical system. This helps your heart to beat normally again. ICDs are usually fitted using a procedure called transvenous implantation, which usually takes between one and three hours. You'll be given local anaesthetic to numb the area. This means you're awake, but shouldn't feel any pain. A small cut, about five to six centimeters, is made on the left side of your chest. The wires that connect the ICD to your heart will be put into a vein and guided to your heart with the help of an X-ray. The ICD is then fitted into a small space in your chest between your skin and your chest muscle, just below the collarbone. Once in place, the procedure is complete. Most people can't feel the ICD as it's the size of a small matchbox, about five by six centimeters, and doesn't weigh much. You'll usually need to stay in hospital overnight and have a day's rest after the procedure. Your ICD will be thoroughly checked before you leave to make sure it's working properly. Most people can go back to light activities after the procedure. An ICD battery usually lasts between four and six years. When the battery is running low, you'll need to go back into hospital and have a new ICD box fitted. If you're nervous or have any questions about having an ICD, speak to your doctor or specialist nurse. For more information on having an ICD, search bhf.org.uk forward slash ICD.